My name is Valerie Daly and I'm the teaching principal in Claha National School in County Offaly. We are very lucky to have um, Daniel Daly in our school. He's visually impaired and has been so since he was um, in senior infants. I am currently his class teacher and we use um, many types of assistive technology to help him in his learning. He also uses a Perkins Brailler um, in his everyday life so he can braille out his own work and work at his own pace. Daniel uses many different types of assistive technology. Um, his Braille Note is one of the main things that he uses. He has access to the internet on that. Um, he can email his homework into school. I can give him some instant feedback on how he's getting on. This is my Braille Note over here and I use it for um, writing stories, reading emails and sending emails, looking up stuff on the internet, for, on Google, for getting visual display. I use it for the time, um, email. The Braille Note, it came from England and it's used, he used it for playing games and used for emailing, music, um, internet, and he, he, it just brings it everywhere now. Open the document, folder name, press enter for spellings. Well, the best thing about the Braille Note is, I suppose, like I can carry it pretty much anywhere and I can do pretty much anything on it. I could play a game or do a story. And if there was internet and I, if I had the password and all the right um, settings, I could go send emails and look up stuff on the internet. He can write, he loves writing stories and it has a dictionary on it. If he doesn't spell something right, it corrects him and you have to keep going until you get the proper spelling. I suppose if I didn't have the Braille though, I'd have to use the Perkins Brailler all the time and it, it's not as quick as the Braille note. And if I made a mistake, I'd have to rub it out and go, go all over it again. And it's just, it kind of smudges the paper. And with the Braille note, I can just click um, the delete button on a word and it's gone. I can just write it all over again really quickly. The technology has changed. Only for NCBI, it has made such a difference to Daniel's life and thanks to them that they have involved us and him. There, have been, there has been lots of talk that Braille is being replaced by technology and to a degree, uh, yes it has been, but I think Braille can complement technology and here's an example of digital Braille being used very successfully and, and in, in a number of schools around the country being used very successfully and it's something that we at NCBI promote and I suppose as somebody who's blind myself and working in NCBI I promote passionately and we want to see that happening more and more. I am I'm going to Banner Secondary School. I think it goes with me because there's a boy in there by the name of Jordan Mahoney and I think he's bringing his to St Joseph's when he goes next year. The future for people like Daniel is very exciting. I, I, I mean I think in NCBI we never cease to be amazed not just at what the technology can do but what kids around the country are making it do that we, that we haven't thought about, which is, which is fantastic. 